Hi, Dennis again. On my quest for cool al fresco dining here in Cavite area. So last week I was in Tagaytay and uh, previously uh, I was also in Alfonso. So now I'm here in Silang. I'm actually in uh, Salakot restaurant. Located in Silang, Cavite along Emilio Aguinaldo Highway. If coming from Manila heading to Tagaytay, Salakot is on your left. And about one kilometer on your right is Hacienda Outlet Mall. Near the entrance, they have this Instagram selfie corner with neon sign that says, Smooth out your day with Salakot coffee. So, okay, I'm having one right now. So for Al Fresco Dining, they have this Kubo Kubo. So you can dine in private with your family, friends, or with your special someone. They also have this elevated twin Kubo, pero para sa dalawang tao lang, para sa mga nagde-dates. And further inside, they have this ace-type triangular mini Kubo, where you can eat cross-legged. But this is not for seniors like me. <laughs> Near the main entrance, they have this foliage tunnel going to the pavilion. Parang grand entrance in the thing. And this is their pavilion. Medyo may pagka rustic and Filipiniana ang design. So this can be the place for wedding reception, debutants, and for ordinary birthday parties. Overall basic design, of course, a yung salakot. They have them on walls, on ceilings for lightings, and so on. So today with me is my youngest son, Baste. To order, kailangan iring mo yung bell para makuha nila yung order. Today we were joined by my sister, Simonette, and my nephew, si Brian. So we ordered bulado, of course. Tokwat Bagnet, Inihaw na Liempo, and Buffalo Wings. Sa mga orders namin, ang nagustuhan ko talaga ay yung Pasitriyo with Bagnet. The others are quite normal, pero okay naman, masarap naman. But nag-stand out talaga yung Pasitriyo with Bagnet. So for Salakot, I'm giving them 3 uh, spoons out of 5. Okay, this is all for now. Uh, di ko pa alam kung saan ako nakapunta next time anyhow i hope you enjoy this video so please give it a like share and subscribe so you can join me on my next foodie journey bonsai making or some diy project Bye.